So we're going to play a game. We're going to play the Trish table game. Okay. So what I want you to do is just relax. Take a couple of deep breaths. As you exhale, kind of melt. Feel yourself melt just from head to toe. Just slowly melt into the table. So as you're breathing, as you exhale, I want you to feel how your head melts into the table. And the next exhale, feel how your upper body melts into the table. And then feel your hips. And then feel your legs. Okay, now hold your leg up. And all of a sudden you're strong there. Wow. Okay, so what happened? Um, all I did was I helped you get tuned into you. So again, my job is to help you get a more accurate read of your brain and your body. So the communication brain to body to brain. Now you also, in your head, you have, you have two brains. You have a right side and a left side. You can say there's three because there's a lower brain too, okay? So we do wanna look at that. So let me have you go ahead and turn to your stomach if you would. Okay, and so then we're gonna check. And so we got a little bit of difference in the muscle tone here from right to left. And in the hips we'll check. A little bit of difference there. And in the feet, I mean, literally your right leg looks a little bit longer than your left. Okay, so we don't wanna leave that that way. We wanna correct for that. So I'm gonna use these blocks again. And now you're gonna breathe. As you breathe, you're actually kind of moving around these blocks and that's sending information to your brain. And uh, I didn't make this up. Some really, really smart people somewhere in a strange land figured out how to how to message your brain preferentially so that we can uh, boost up the activity in one side versus the other and so balance the two. Um, have you ever heard of uh, integration, like working on integration of brain function? Yeah. So it's a really popular thing now um, because the better integrated the brain, the, the better the function. And there are integrative centers in the brain and they actually control the integrative function. So <clears throat> your right side of your brain controls the left side of your body for voluntary movement. Left side of your brain controls the right side. But there's all these other functions that we don't really discuss as much. And uh, for all these functions to work at their best, the two sides of your brain have to be integrated as well as the upper and lower parts of your brain. So the, you know, like I said, if we call it three parts, we can say the three parts have to work together really well. So all I'm doing right now is I'm using some different triggers that, like I said, some really smart people figured out would help to integrate these different uh, functions of your brain. Deep breath in, exhale. So we're just gonna work on mobility here. Now sometimes you'll get some cracking and popping. That's not really our goal. We're not doing an adjustment. Again, we're just moving these, these muscles. Deep breath in. Exhale, as they move the muscles, they signal the brain. So they kind of gain your brain's attention. Okay, and so already the muscles here look more balanced. Your legs are the same length. We'll pull these out. And let's have you go ahead and turn to your back again. Now we wanna look and see, did everything hold up the way we wanted it to? Okay, hold, go chest up for me. Okay, good, so that held up. Let's look here, hold the leg up. So that one fell off a little bit, okay? Remember I had you fix that one with your thoughts? Yeah. Okay, so different messaging to the brain has a different impact, right? So we wanna send a powerful message that's gonna create a long-term impact, something more durable that's gonna carry with you as you go through your day so that you can feel more comfortable when you move. And uh, also, you know, in terms of being able to perform, being able to get your muscles to do what you want them to do, you know, you're gonna put in this work, you want that payback. So we have to have this uh, connection brain to body to brain, and then also brain to brain. And if we have that integration, it's called neurological balance. And there's a really smart guy that I, I uh, is actually my mentor, a neuro target system. That's what this is, this is all drawn from, is the neuro target system. And that, again, that's just 
helping your brain read what's going on in your body more accurately so that you can get the results you're looking for and, and avoid the pain and the injuries and things like that. I'm gonna have you go ahead and turn over one more time. This is part of your workout today, <laughs> turning over. And then slide your hips and legs over to the left side of the table. Uh, hips over there too. There we go. Okay. So all I'm going to do is try and affect some of that imbalance that we saw. So this is the direction. Remember when I when I bent you this way, you were strong. Okay. And so again, I'm just using your muscles to talk to your brain. Help your brain understand better, more accurately what's going on in your body. And you can use your own brain to do that, to benefit that. Now, there's lots of different versions of it, but there's a, there's a practice called mindfulness. And that's one of the ways to help you get a much more accurate view. This is called NeuroTarget, and that's me helping you get a better view. <laughs> and so I can cheat. I can do things that uh, give uh, more impact. Now, another thing that really helps you to keep this connection, to keep this uh, accurate read. Go ahead and turn to your back again. I told you this part of your workout. <laughs> this accurate read of your brain to body to brain and, and brain to brain is posture. Mm. So yeah, it's the, and so go. that's, yeah. that held it's up strong. nicely even as you turn. So last time even just turning over that kind of fell apart, this time it, it stayed yeah, together. And so, so that's what we're looking for. And so I think Brain's we're, amazing. we're ready to train today and, and <laughs> right. uh, make sure we can do that in a way that keeps you from getting hurt. Sounds great. All right. Yeah. Thanks. thanks